Hello Cancer, this is Bonnie from Soul Star Bliss with your 2018 mini tarot reading. I just can't believe it's the end of the year already. And before we begin, I just wanted to take a moment and thank you for your support all year of liking, sharing, and subscribing to my channel. Uh, please stop by my Facebook page and like that too if you would, but I just wanted to say I so appreciate you. And those of you that have had readings, bless me with readings. Thank you. And I wanted to say happy holidays from my house to yours. And with that said, Cancer, let's see what's coming up for you this year. Oop. Got the Ace of Cups. When your mind is filled with spirit, fills your body to overflowing. What you think about, you become. That's such big medicine in itself when you think of those words. Think of the children. What they think about, they become. We as adults, what we think about, we become. I just... I don't know, that's a very powerful statement to me personally anyway. With that said, let's take a look. It says a lot of wants, wishes, and daydreams are kind of floating around for you. Maybe it's uh, time to decide what you want to do for next year. Okay, make a plan, or maybe maybe not make a plan, but it just says take care of some of those wants and wishes that you want to, and that would be an interesting month for you. Looks like some travel. You've had some travel this year that was both happy and some that wasn't so happy, but it says all in all throughout the year, it looks like it's been a good year for a lot of you. You have the sun card, which is a lot of happiness or joy. It says too that maybe some changes were made in your in your finances. Maybe you were worried. Maybe you had a bankruptcy. Maybe you had a you know loss of money. Maybe whatever it is. Maybe you had a change of jobs, got laid off. I just feel for you that there's going to be an improvement this month and it's going to carry into next year. Prosperity Changes in your income for the better are really looking good right here. It says you've made some changes um, within yourself even that's going to help uh, connect with partner. I feel like a home is really important to a lot of you. Um, like maybe your home body, I guess, is what I'm saying. But I said step outside of your comfort zone and see what happens. It looks like there's going to be blessings for you in, in many different ways here. It says you're going to feel like a winner this month. It says even though you felt alone off and on throughout the year, it says this month it's going to be like your family comes together. Even if it's just in spirit, if maybe you're too far away, you can't get together. But it looks like you're going to feel really good about family in general. When you feel good about family, that can make you feel really good about yourself. New opportunities may be coming to you. Okay, I just and I feel spirit has something to do with that. Maybe you're going to have a dream. Maybe you're going to see something. Maybe you're going to, you know, open that drawer that you've closed for a long time of something you've wanted to do. But I just feel that something is going to inspire you to make some changes that carry through next year. And it says, even though if there's sadness from the past, even if you can, you don't have to forgive or forget, but you might even just lay it down for a while and try to move forward. It says, in your relationship department, of course, those of you that are in a relationship, it looks like there's blessings there or improvements or communication even that's going to be good for you. I feel reasons to celebrate this month are going to be good. And in the financial area, you have X amount of money right now, but I feel something you're going to do. Maybe you get a part-time job. Maybe you do a craft. Maybe you have an invention. I'm not sure what it is, but it's really going to help uh, increase your finances. And it says maybe you even change jobs or um, something similar to that. And most important is remember, we can't go back and change the past. We can learn from it. We can dwell in it. We can stay there or we can move forward. I just feel that changes that you've made this year are going to definitely move forward with you. You have so much spirit angels help around you. And victory, you're going to feel like a victor this month. Like victory is truly yours. Maybe wish is granted. Maybe you see someone from the past or have a good memory of them. But I feel when you gather with family during the holidays or even any time this month, is going to inspire you to make changes for you and for your, if you have a family, for your family. Um, it says you even have the opportunity to get exactly what you want, and I feel really good about that for you. Simply by looking at things and making changes. It might just be in here, or you have the courage and inspiration to change something that works for everybody. Commitments that you make, be a person of your word. I feel that cancers usually are a person of their word, but once you make your commitment to make a change, specifically with family, with partner, or even at work, make sure you keep your word going to be important. It says if your word is not kept, things won't be quite as as pretty or as nice, I guess, as, as they could be. It says something is already in the works for you. Alms dispense with justice. I really feel an increase in your income for you, which is always a good thing. It says your intuition is going to take you where you need to go. Um, even though you've kind of 
waiting to hear, waiting to decide. It says, don't give your power away. If you really want to go somewhere, you want to do something, or you want to start a business, or you want to change something, if you have a partner, work it out that it works for both of you or for your family, or even at work. But it says, when you do what you love, you're going to increase your, your income by quite a bit here, or opportunities. And it can be prosperity. Prosperity isn't always money. Maybe it's joy, bliss, and ease that you seek. But I see that there's changes for you for the better in all areas coming up. But just be a person of your word, and I just have a feeling things are going to be quite nice for you, Cancer. This is Bonnie from Soul Star Bliss. Happy holidays from my house to yours. And again, I so appreciate you watching, sharing, liking. And I, I will see you again next month.